Hello and welcome coffee beans. For today's video we will be testing our vocabulary. But before anything else, please subscribe like and share for more videos. General engineering basic terminologies. There will be 20 questions each questions will be repeated twice only. After 5 questions, the answers will be shown. Let's get started. It is the best known conductor of electricity. But reacts with air and water and make them useless for making connections in an electric circuit. The choice is based on lowest resistance per unit length. I'll repeat. It is the best known conductor of electricity, but reacts with air and water and make them useless for making connections in an electric circuit. The choice is based on lowest resistance per unit length. It is expressed as the ratio at which the given surface emits radiation to the rate of radiation of a black body at the same temperature. Again, it is expressed as the ratio at which the given surface emits radiation to the rate of radiation of a black body at the same temperature. It is the sum of the products obtained by multiplying all the infinitely small areas by the square of their distances to the neutral axis. Again, it is the sum of the products obtained by multiplying all the infinitely small areas by the square of their distances to the neutral axis. It is the moment of inertia for an area relative to a line or axis perpendicular to the plane of the area. Again, it is the moment of inertia for an area relative to a line or axis perpendicular to the plane of the area. It is the length of the arc of the pitch circle between two consecutive corresponding profiles. Again, it is the length of the arc of the pitch circle between two consecutive corresponding profiles. Answers. 1. Cesium. 2. Emissivity of a surface. 3. Modules of inertia. 4. Polar moment of inertia. 5. Circular pitch. Did you got all the 5? Nice one. Good luck for the next 5. It is a steel that contains significant quantities of recognized alloying metals. The most common being aluminum chromium, etc. Again, it is a steel that contains significant quantities of recognized alloying metals. The most common being aluminum, chromium, etc. It is a steel processed by working at room temperatures. Most expensive than hot rolled steel. Again, it is a steel processed by working at room temperatures. Most expensive than hot rolled steel. It is the amount of power needed to magnetize or demagnetize a permanent magnet. Again, it is the amount of power needed to magnetize or demagnetize a permanent magnet. The velocity at which a sphere will rise or fall in a liquid varies as the square of its diameter. Again, the velocity at which a sphere will rise or fall in a liquid varies as the square of its diameter. It is the cyclic physical resistance felt in some alternator designs from magnets passing the coils and gaps in the laminates. Detrimental to start up. Again, it is the cyclic physical resistance felt in some alternator designs from magnets passing the coils and gaps in the laminates. Detrimental to start up. Answers. 6. Wrought alloy steel. 7. Coil rolled steel. 8. Corsivity. 9. Stokes equation. 10. Cogging. Congratulations. We're halfway done. It is a graph with values of deformation on the abscissa and values of force on the ordinate. Again. It is a graph with values of deformation on the abscissa and values of force on the ordinate. A type of pump having one or more stages. Each consisting of an impeller on a vertical shaft. Surrounded by stationary and usually symmetrical guide vanes. Again. A type of pump having one or more stages each consisting of an impeller on a vertical shaft, surrounded by stationary and usually symmetrical guide vanes, is the ratio of the increment of unit deformation. It is a measure of stiffness of materials. Again, is the ratio of the increment of unit deformation. It is a measure of stiffness of materials. It is the measure of the resistance of materials to bending stresses. Again, it is the measure of the resistance of materials to bending stresses. The simultaneous production of two useful forms of energy, heat and power, it is a cost-effective energy resource option for the industry. Again, the simultaneous production of two useful forms of energy, heat and power, it is a cost-effective energy resource option for the industry. Answers. 11. Force deformation curve. 12. Turbine pump. 13. Modules of elasticity. 14. Modules of rupture. 15. Cogeneration. Yes. 5 questions more. A regulation method based on duty cycle. At full power. A pulse width modulated circuit provides electricity 100% of the time. At half power, the PWM is on half time and off half the time. The speed of this alternation is generally very fast. Used in both solar wind regulators to efficiently provide regulation. I'll repeat. A regulation method based on duty cycle. At full power, a pulse width modulated circuit provides electricity 100% of the time. At half power, the PWM is on half time and off half the time. The speed of this alternation is generally very fast. Used in both solar wind regulators to efficiently provide regulation. Refers to the quantity of fluid in motion per a unit of time. It is expressed in mass per unit time or volume per unit time. Again. Refers to the quantity of fluid in motion per a unit of time. 
It is expressed in mass per unit time or volume per unit time. A normal wind turbine design, in which the shaft is parallel to the ground, and the blades are perpendicular to the ground. Again, a normal wind turbine design, in which the shaft is parallel to the ground, and the blades are perpendicular to the ground. The area of each sieve shall be the product of its length and exposed width. Measured in square meters to the nearest hundredth. Again, the area of each sieve shall be the product of its length and exposed width. Measured in square meters to the nearest hundredth. The tensile stress in the wall of the pipe in the circumferential orientation due to internal hydrostatic pressure. Again, the tensile stress in the wall of the pipe in the circumferential orientation due to internal hydrostatic pressure. Last set of answers. 16. Pulse width modulation. 17. Flow rate. 18. Horizontal axis wind turbine. 19. Cleaning sieve area. 20. Hoop stress. Got it all. Congratulations for passing the familiarization of basic terminologies. Hope it helps. See you again in the next vocabulary. Thank you and God bless.